So, today I'm showing you the best PK stats for GPU Update 8. Now, I have done two videos of these already, one before the update and one after the update. However, these are some updated stats that include Cyborg. So, if you do not have Cyborg, these stats probably won't apply to you. However, you can still kind of uh, tweak them uh, to your liking. Basically, if you're using uh, Blackleg over Kashiki, put 20 points in, whatnot, so on and so forth. However, this is going to be using Cyborg. So, as you can see, I have zero in strength, 350 in stamina, and 200 in defense which gives me 1188 uh, HP and 992 stamina. I'll show you what accessories we got on in a minute. And I've got 491 in Devil Fruit, which is the max damage for Pika. If you put 641 in there, I believe that's the number. You might want to go check that on the wiki. That's the max burn damage. I believe you put in like an extra 200 skill points and it only increased the burn damage by two or three, something like that. So it's not really too worth it. However, if you do want that extra bit of burn damage, you can go put that in. Now, I only have 100 in Sword Mastery because this is more for PvE. And how often do you actually end one your sword during PvE, like when you're fighting bosses or whatnot? Rarely, basically. So I've only got 100 in Sword, and I'm mostly using Great Sword uh, just because it's got like a higher M1 scaling. Uh, so, like, I think I do about 19, 17 M1 damage with the Great Sword at the minute. We only have 100 points in, which is pretty good. And then to end off with Cyborg Mastery, I have 584 in Cyborg, which is pretty much what was left over, basically. Uh, because if you're doing something like the factory uh, and you want to get damage to law or the slime tanker real quickly you can obviously use pika ultimate use a pika light ray and then you can switch to cyborg and you can use missile shower and machine gun blows and it like just really good damage basically so yeah just gonna scroll through these one last time these are my stats 350 stamina 200 defense 491 devil fruit zero in gun 100 in sword and 584 in cyborg and then as you can see here i get 520 extra health 6.5 hp region 8 stamina region and 4.73 percent reduced damage this is given from doflamingo's outfit drums a purple armor so just cracking armor doflamingo shades more of your necklace lost cap wings of leo lantern of hope and a uh, cracking cape. They're not loading in too quickly, so I'll just mention them all. You can see, you can see them all apart from this one. So yeah, th th that's, that's all I've got equipped. Uh, I don't have a title that gives me anything else. Uh, this is all that's giving me the extra stuff. Uh, but yeah, they are what stats I would probably recommend you use over any other ones that I have mentioned. Just because, you know, it uses that cyborg damage, which for PvE is really, really OP. Cyborg is like the best fighting style in the game, without a doubt. Anyway, that's it for this video. Hope you enjoyed. Be sure to like, subscribe, click that bell so you don't miss a video. Uh, join the Discord down below in the description. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.